Hello. In this video, we are going to show you how you can uh, disable the zoom in or zoom out effect for this slider. In this manner, you will be able to use the slider as a basic slider uh, without uh, uh, zoom in or zoom out effect. Uh, you can disable the, uh, this effect for uh, only for one uh, image if you need or for uh, the entire slider. Let's for example uh, disable it for uh, one image. You will just set uh, one, one, zero. So uh, the final, uh, the initial zoom and final zoom will be equal to one, and of course the zoom duration will be zero. Update now. Go to front end, and you'll see the first image has uh, zoom effect. The second image doesn't have and of course the third uh, image has. Uh, now uh, let's uh, disable for the entire uh, slider. As I said in uh, banner settings you have uh, this uh, default settings. So you just set them to uh, zero for duration and one for uh, Default and default initial zoom and default final zoom. Um, of course, you can uh, set this uh, with this center update uh, in playlist. You just set uh, this as default, meaning that uh, you will leave uh, uh, blank. The same for the second. And uh, for the third, which is already black. Now if you refresh, you'll see the uh, slider does not have uh, any zoom effect. Um, uh, for this type of slider, basic slider, uh, it is recommended that you will load uh, images having the exact uh, dimension of the slider. For uh, zooming effect, uh, you will load larger images, which is uh, what we have uh, now. You can uh, work with this too. For example, uh, just set uh, right and uh, top update. Fresh, and uh, you'll also have a, um, a nice image there. Uh, as you see, the transition between the slides is uh, fade. You can uh, set uh, another uh, type of transition, which is uh, a slide transition. So uh, you just set face slides false. Now uh, refresh and uh, you'll have the slide transition. Uh, so it's up to you if you'll use uh, fade transition or uh, slide transition to navigate between the slides. Enjoy!